Do you think Miller is as bad as we think he is? I mean, he was nice to us. He doesn't have to be all bad just to do something wrong. I wonder what he found. The coast is clear. Ah, oh, this looks gross. It smells even worse. This one's easy for Ghost Rider. He doesn't have a nose. Hey, there's Mobile Shredding Corporation. Yeah, but what does the rest say? I can't figure it out. It's all gunked up with ketchup and grease and stuff. Come on, let's get out of here before somebody sees us. Now we can take another look. Let's see if this note will tell us what Miller's going to shred. And when. Jamal's dad has pads just like these. In his office, they say from the desk of Reginald Jenkins. So this must say from the desk of John Miller. Miller was probably making notes to himself. Hmm. This says Mobile Shredding Corp at 12 p.m. Saturday. Great. We found out when and where. Now I have to find out what he's going to shred blow up of one dollar check for children's home foe something. A blow up of a check. We saw that outside of Miller's office, remember? He gave the children's home a thousand dollars. So one dollar must be one thousand dollars. And these words must be photo session. Well, he's not going to shred that. Keep going. There's something else. Get French garment invoice? This must be invoices. You know, an invoice is like a bill. It shows the price you have to pay for something. We get them in the store all the time. So the invoices must show the price French garment paid to have Miller haul their perk. That's what Miller's planning to shred. We've got it all. These invoices are proof that Miller hauled French garment's perk. And that's why he wants to shred them. Hey, Alex, Miller was yelling at someone to get him the papers by Saturday. Do you think he's planning to steal French Garment's invoices? I wouldn't put it past them. We've got to get those invoices before Miller does. Got your appetite back, huh? Yeah. Well, wow, it must be morning already, because I know you don't like breakfast food for dinner. Very funny. Lenny. I'm trying to understand what's the matter. Talk to me. Has it got anything to do with Sally? I thought you liked her. I do like her. I like her a lot. I like her, too. No. Now, I know I haven't gone out with anybody since your mom died. Maybe it's difficult picturing your old man with somebody else, huh? I don't know. I mean, Sally's real nice, but 
Yeah. I don't, I don't know, okay? When? For years, after your mom died, I couldn't even think of seeing anybody else. I thought it was being disloyal to your mom, you know what I mean? Sort of. I guess I was afraid that starting a new relationship meant forgetting your mom, and I didn't want to do that. I never want to forget, Mom. And I guess I don't want you to forget her either. Yeah, well, that's just the thing, Lenny. I've begun to realize that a new relationship doesn't have to mean forgetting the old. And whatever happens with Sally or anybody else that I might meet, your mom is still every bit as special to me as she was when she was alive. Does that make any sense to you? I guess. And you are the most special thing of all in my life. And you always will be. I have an idea. What are you doing? Dry cereal? That's no dinner for a growing girl. How about... Waffles! Yes! <laughs> Mama, we'll talk to you. No time. Boss is in a right mood. Somebody broke in here last night. Broke in? What did they steal? Nothing. Isn't that weird? All they did was trash the boss's office. There were papers and invoices all over the floor. Invoices? Listen, we've been trying to figure out this case. And we think we know the guy who trashed your boss's office. The same guy that dumped the barrels in our garden. So? So would he talk to us? Maybe he could help us catch this guy Miller. The kids would be cartooning. Well, we can help him. Look, come back when you've got some help. Somebody who doesn't go to the movies on a child's ticket. What are we going to do, Alex? Without those invoices, there's no way to prove Miller hauled the perk and dumped it in our garden. We've got to figure out some way to stop him from turning those invoices tomorrow. I know. <laughs> 